Hi guys, Gilliam Elliott here with an educational video on medical tourism. Today I want to take a brief second to talk about medical tourism websites and why they're so important for your medical tourism startup. Uh, and one of the reasons why I chose this topic is because I speak to medical tourism startups on a daily basis and a lot of times they ask me, what do you think uh, the most important thing for my business is? And while there's a multitude of, uh, of things to consider when starting up your company, uh, one main thing is having a medical tourism website that's user friendly and that converts at a high rate. Um, and I want to just talk about a little, a little bit about what uh, what contributes to that. So when you have a medical tourism website, um, it's like it's it's like your business card online. Um, in medical tourism, uh, you, a lot of times you don't get a chance to meet your clients face to face. Uh, so the first interaction they have with your brand is through your website. And if you have a good website, then they're going to have a positive experience with your brand from the initial start. If you have a bad medical tourism website, then they're going to have a bad experience or a bad connotation of your website or your brand from the very beginning. And since you're a medical tourism startup, a lot of times uh, you're going to run into credibility issues with prospects. So if a prospective client goes to your website, um, they're looking around, they might not have never heard of your brand before. Um, and so they're going to look for things that lend credibility to your brand. And one way to get credibility through your website is to have things like uh, patient reviews on there from former clients. Also to have things like logos and emblems from hospitals that you work with around the world. Um, also other things like uh, logos of memberships you're part of, a certification logos. Things like this give your clients or your prospective clients, um, they, they give them confidence to work with your brand. They show your clients that you hold yourself to a higher standard and it also makes them more apt to reach out to you uh, and to give you the information. So when you have a medical tourism website, there's a lot of things you want to make sure you put on the website uh, so people will opt into your website so you can get a lot of leads. One of those things is having chat functionality. And the reason why I'm the reason why I talk about chat functionality so much is because chat functionality is less risk for the client. So they don't feel like they have to give you their email address, their name, and all their personal information to have interaction with you. So they can simply go to your website, ask you a quick, quick question, um, get feedback from you. And then what you can do is once you have uh, interaction with this client through your chat functionality online, then you can take it a step further and ask the client contact information. But chat functionality is a great way to build trust without the client having to give you too much information in the initial interaction. Um, something else you want to make sure you have in there is call to action buttons. When I say call to action buttons, what I mean is these are buttons that get clients or visitors attention when they get on your website. Buttons that say things like uh, call today or buttons that say uh, reach out to us today to get a free quote. Um, things like that, they get their attention and a lot of times these buttons have, uh, they're really colorful and they, they draw attention to them. So these are just some brief points that I want to go over uh, about how to make your website more credible and how to attract more patients to your website and get more opt-ins and, and more clients to give you the information. But if you guys are looking for more detailed information, you guys can check out our certification program. It goes over all these points and it goes way deeper into how to make sure that you have the best medical tourism website possible.